What is up guys, my name is Brandon and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make this. The DIY overhead camera rig that I made for around $10. Now, as you can see, this is a basically just a soccer bowl type structure made from PVC pipe that has a few clamps up here and some pieces of wood for the stands. So it's very easy and cheap to make. So I will get into how to make it right now. All right, guys. So these are all the parts you're going to need. You're going to need obviously a camera that has a tripod screw mount and I used this GoPro clamp for my camera rig but you can also get a regular camera clamp for this I'll link one in the in the description below along with the rest of these supplies I also used some uh, other GoPro adapters this one is a uh, perpendicular GoPro adapter that makes it go from straight this way to up and down and then I also use this GoPro adapter that allows you to connect something with a tripod screw and then I also used some various GoPro screws to fasten the mounts as well as a small piece of duct tape to secure it fully some PVC pipe I got a uh, three foot one which is a long one and I believe two uh, one and a half to two foot poles um, and I also used some super glue and hot glue to glue those pieces of wood right there to the PVC pipe so in all this cost me about ten to fifteen dollars the PVC pipe was very cheap I already had the camera as well as the GoPro mounts and the duct tape and the wood so I just paid for the PVC pipe so if you're going to buy all this stuff from scratch excluding the camera it's probably going to be about twenty five to thirty dollars so even if you have to buy all this from scratch it's, it is still very cheap to build so now that I've told you guys what I have used now let's get into building it all right, all right, guys. We have the PVC pipes now. Uh, two five length, five foot length, half inch. Oh no, no, three quarter inch PVC pipe. So let's go down to the garage and set these up so we can make our overhead camera rig. All right, guys. So here we have the two. Uh, sticks there and there um, so those are going to act as the legs for this rig and this long five foot PVC pipe is going to act as the um, the crossbar um, which is going to hold the camera so I'm gonna start with three feet and if I don't like that then we'll go down to two and a half feet so let's mark this off and then we can cut it. Okay, so I'm going to mark it right here. And now we will go down and try cutting it. All right, guys, we have finished the three foot length PVC pipe. Uh, it is actually very long. I might shorten it, but for now I'm just going to keep it how it is. So let's put on some of these um, connectors so we can see what it looks like basically put all together. Alright, so we are definitely going to need to get some legs. Alright guys, so I've been thinking about what to do for the legs of the uh, overhead camera rig and I've 
I've come up with an idea that might work. Um, I'm going to try to use these uh, little small pieces of wood. Um, it's going to be about, uh, I think it's like a fourth of an inch thick, and it's going to be about an inch and a half by maybe like five inches or so, something like that. So let me go into the garage and see what I have and see if that will work. Okay guys, so this is what I found. Um, it is about a fourth of an inch thick, and I think it's probably probably around eight inches or so in length, um, and it's about half an, an inch and a half across. Um, so I'm going to try to cut this in half and use these as a leg, as as legs, um, and just super glue them to the bottom of the PVC pipe. So let me cut these real quick, and we'll see how it goes. All right guys, so here's the finished product. So I'm going to try to hot glue it. And if this doesn't work, I'm, I might try uh, putting some Velcro on the wood and the PVC pipe, but this should work. So I'll wait until this heats up and then we will hot glue the PVC pipe to the piece of wood. All right, it is pretty hot right now. And just like that, guys, it can already support its own weight. So I'm going to now move on to the next uh, leg. All right, guys, so there it is pretty much 100% dry. Um, so now I'm going to connect, connect these together with the uh, crossbar and see if it works or if it doesn't work. All right, guys, so there you have it. It is fairly stable. Um, it's kind of wobbly a little bit, but that's mostly because the wood I had wasn't perfectly uh, straight. So if you do make this, try to get the straightest wood you can find because that is definitely going to be a factor in this kind of build. Um, so now all I have left to do is um, put a hole for the tripod screw uh, in the um, in the center of the crossbar and that's pretty much it so let's go do that right now and then we'll wrap up the video all right guys so i've decided not to use the drill to drill a hole and then put in the tripod screw because it's kind of uh hard to do and not everybody has the required stuff um so instead of using a drill to drill a hole i'm going to use this bike mount for a gopro along with a adapter that will let me attach any camera using a tripod screw. Okay, so once you get the clamp on your PVC pipe as shown here, all you have to do is get your perpendicular GoPro adapter and attach that to the clamp as shown here, and then screw it in with the screw. Make sure it's tight. And then once that's done, you can attach your camera to your tripod screw adapter and then attach that here and screw that in with the screw. And then once you get it tight, make sure everything is good. And there you have it guys, that is the overhead camera rig. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, definitely leave a like and subscribe. And also, don't forget to check out this video right here that is going to be on a magnetic tripod adapter. And anyways, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.